Ah, crap. Okay. Pretty sure I already killed it, but there is actually a a non-aggressive crow in this bunch. Um, it will actually not attack you, kind of no matter what you do to it. Um, but in the process of me killing everything else, I killed it. So whatever. Yeah, these games. Um, I mean, I find them to be a lot of fun, but they are certainly, like, stressful as hell. So I can definitely understand if they are not, you know, everybody's particular cup of tea. Okay, so I still need four of those. Ooh, bone marrow ash. So bone marrow ash is really good for guns. Ah! I mean, even as experienced as I am with these games, I um, still do enjoy watching like some like really high-end speedrunners or. <laughs> Um, people that do challenge runs. Um, one of the, the kind of most well-known ones is a guy by the name of Lobos Jr. who, like, he's done, um, like, a gun-only run. He's done fists-only. Like, all of these weird runs that you wouldn't think anybody would ever even be capable of doing, and he finds a way to pull it off. Come on. Uh, oh, come on. With your Molotov cocktails. God, I forgot about this. Oh my god. You with the Molotov, seriously. Fuck off. Can't quite reach you. So you know what? Fuck you. Dog. All right. Uh... Well, there are definitely some um, like lore playthroughs that you can find. Um, and actually, one guy—he um, was one of the first ones I watched. His name is. Um, I think he goes by Epic Name Bro. He actually helped write the official guide. Uh, him and another guy that I... His name escapes me right now, but... Um, they're... Pretty thorough. They're, they may not be, like... 
the most skilled like players ever for the game, but they definitely know a ton about this game. Okay, so there we go. Not missing anything. All right. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. will make use of this shortcut that I unlocked before. See ya. Okay. So I'm going to try to just run past most of this because I really don't feel like fighting my way through it. forgot about you. Can't believe I missed that thing actually. Okay. Going to ignore you. And you. And all of you. And sorry lady, don't got time for you. Yeah, 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 I hear ya. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, I don't want to fuck with the executioners. Alright, shortcut.
really, lady? Alright. Now that I've unlocked that shortcut, let's see if I can get my echoes back. Still a few blood shards short. And now I have all of them. Alright, so now I can get to a plus six. Come on. Ooh, ooh. All right. So definitely like just running through like a madman will get you to where you need to go. Um, just like fighting will, but, um, you know, I feel like that kind of illustrated that while fighting did, like, I could get through that with just fighting, the easiest way to do it, at least for me at this point, um, especially with a low-level character, is to try to trick the, ah, the enemies into, ah, come on is to try to trick the enemies into attacking me one at a time, or at least as close to one at a time as I can. Because um, trying to fight even like two or three of them at a, at a time, even weak enemies, can easily kill you in this game. Um, okay, so I'm going to... Uh, upgrade and probably buy spend my echoes on some stuff and then take on the next boss then it will be vicar amelia and i think that'll be it for tonight uh basically yeah attack so I'll just do that and what's my, what's my vile situation look like eh. might as well let's improve that a little bit okay so the next boss that I'm gonna do um, there is a kind of an easy strategy for for them. Um, I'll try it without the, using this kind of easy strategy, but um, if I can't beat them on the first go, like fighting them normally, then I'll use the easy strategy just because I don't really want to waste a lot of time with them. Um, but we'll see how it goes. Time you want to leave me alone. Come on.
Okay, so the trick to these guys is to basically ignore the weird tentacle-headed thing and actually locate the witch, which is right here. Alright, so the trick to this is there's actually two witches. One of them, though, ah, you can only see the health bar um, at the beginning. Um, and once you kill one, then you can see both of their health bars. But if I don't kill the second one fast enough, she'll revive the first. So I need to find her quickly. Quickly, quickly, where are you? There you go. Alright, not too bad. And unfortunately when she dies, these guys will go with her. 